know, something I'm thankful for every day is uh, God. Um, it's that simple. You know, the clothes on my back, the food on my table, where I live, you know, the friends I have, family, you know what I mean, whatever I have. Hello. One thing I'm thankful for is my family, my friends, and the people that support me. Uh, yeah, pretty much. And I, I also um, thank God. Yeah, that's it. Bye. This quarantine has been like a stronghold for me. And I'm grateful. I'm really grateful. I'm grateful for my relationship with my son. Before we were strangers in the night. And we're talking here and there, but it's a start. And I'm really grateful for that. And I'm doing my part. I'm grateful for my prayer partner. I'm grateful for my job. I'm grateful that I've been able to bring a non-believer to Christ over the phone during this time. I'm grateful for my church. I'm grateful that we were prepared for this and now we have church at home. I'm really grateful for that because I don't want to miss a day of that. I'm grateful. And I'm grateful that I have peace of mind at this time. I'm really grateful and I'm grateful that I'm able to lean on the Lord even more and trust Him. That's key for me because I have a problem with trust and love. And through this time, I'm learning to find myself worth. <laughs> That's different for me, but I'm grateful. I'm so grateful for so many things, but I'm especially grateful for friends and volunteers who have given their um, time and equipment so that um, we can help our pastors and leaders run church every week and encourage people. Um, I'm so grateful for delivery men doing their thing and bringing us food when we need it. And I'm grateful for peace in my home and the love of my family, the safety of my family. Hey everyone, Bobby here. Today I'm thankful for being at home safe with my happy and healthy roommates and my silly dog. For another birthday, eight years today. I'm most thankful for having a home, having food on the table, and having friends and family who are supporting each other through a time like this. And most importantly, I'm thankful to God who has given us all strength and peace to fight everything that we're going through right now. Hi, I'm thankful for Jesus and the love of God and the sacrifice Jesus made for us. And I'm also thankful for the word of God. And, and the promises in the Word of God. I'm thankful for each day of life. I'm thankful for the love of my wife, Conchita, and my sons, and uh, my granddaughter. And I'm also thankful for my Living Word Church family. And I'm thankful for the opportunity to serve, serve God and to serve Him by serving others. Hello. Today I'm thankful for being able to send this message and to be close to people I love. Hope you're doing good. For my family, my friends, and God. Hey, I uh, hope you're doing well. Uh, as you know, I'm PB. Uh, I just wanted to say that I'm truly thankful for my daughter, Jay, uh, for the woman she has become, for being that mighty woman of God. She has truly been uh, essential to uh, this church and living word and I so much appreciate her and I am so thankful that she has become that woman of valor uh, and to be able to be a, in his service uh, so thank God for her and for my other children and for all that the Lord provides me these elders of the church and the leaders and this body of believers that has been just amazing so I have so much to be thankful for so thank you and God bless you all. One thing that I'm truly grateful for and thankful for during these times is definitely prayer. Um, it keeps me consistent, keeps me grounded and rooted in my faith. It reminds me of God's promises that, you know, God is working things out. Despite how I may look, 
I just know that this tough time is definitely going to pass for the world. So I'm just thankful for prayer during these times. God bless. Today, I am truly grateful for love. The love of the Lord, the love of family, the love of friends. And I am super grateful for God's hand of provision. He's so, so faithful. You know, Living Word Church, honestly, I am so grateful that I have a relationship with Jesus Christ. I don't know how people are managing these days, not having that hope, not having that anchor to rely on, to cling to in such trying times. I am so, so blessed and highly favored that the Lord uh, called me out of darkness, called me out of billions of people to serve Him in the spirit of truth and to be one that he can call on and that I'll be there. It is my ambition that I'll be there for him. And I pray this prayer for all of us that as he found grace in Noah, that he will find grace in us as well. God bless you. I, I just wanted to send you a shout out and let you all know that I am so truly grateful for having each and every one of you in my life. I'm so grateful that my family is together and I'm so grateful that my mom is safe. I just want you to do me one favor. I want you to follow the three S's, okay? Stay home, stay safe, and save lives. Love you all.